Hi there, how's everyone doing today? Um, my name is Ghost Oracle, and welcome to the channel. We finally have sound, um, so I'm doing a voiceover for this video. I My camera audio isn't great, so I had to cut that out. Um, but doing something a little different today, I had this deer skeleton, which I uh, salvaged from roadkill. Um, that was a bit of an adventure. Uh, there are a lot more maggots involved than I would have liked, but it was good. So this uh, deer skeleton that I've had has been sitting in a box for probably two, three years now, and I wasn't entirely sure what to do with it. Um, I was trying to think of like a dis way of displaying it, just like in a box, um, like in a glass container, and then I uh, stumbled upon some inspiration um, there's this shop in Denver called the Terrarium Shop, which does like a lot of these bone terrariums and things like that, which looks super cool. Um, have not been yet. I would really like to go someday, but I took a lot of inspiration from them. I guess this is, this isn't technically a terrarium. Um, there aren't any living plants in it, but I wanted something that was low maintenance that looked cool. And so we ended up with this. So I've got the deer cranium in there, a couple vertebrae, um, I think there's some, is it reindeer moss on the bottom? I don't know. I, there's some moss on the bottom and then some eucalyptus leaves and some dried grass and some flowers that I just picked up at the craft store. I don't, I'm not entirely sure what kind of plants they are, but anyway, it looks cool. It took me a while to find a container that was big enough for the skull. Um, I had kind of been looking for glass, like a glass display case. Um, they're really hard to find or like a, a bell jar that would have been big enough. Um, most of them are way too small though. So I again, ended up going to a craft store, found this lantern and was like, this'll fit. So went ahead and put that in there, but yeah. Um, so, thanks for stopping by. Hope you enjoy the rest of the video, and I will catch you all later. Um, if you're enjoying my content, please consider liking and subscribing. That would be awesome. And hopefully I will be back with some more drawing stuff and also some more bone stuff, because I got some smaller displays that I can work on. I got quite a few prairie dog skulls that I need something to do with. So hopefully there will be more videos like this. But anyway, thanks for stopping by. I will catch you all later. Happy hauntings.